What up, YouTube? Tim Roos here. Here's my review for another Ron Howard film, which is the 2011 movie The Dilemma. Now, the film got released back on J January 14, 2011. I remember watching the movie in theaters, by the way. And the reviews wasn't so great. It has like a 24% on Rotten Tomatoes, one of uh, lowest, one of Howard's lowest rating films. But I gotta say, bad reviews or not, the dilemma is awesome. I really adore this film. It's really hilarious. Uh, you've got Vince Vaughn and Kevin James, who of course play these lifelong friends, who are partners in this uh, auto design uh, firm. And so Vince Vaughn's character, uh, Ronnie, ends up pretty much uh, discovering that that his best friend, uh, Nick's wife, played by Wayne Rar, is cheating on him with another uh, man who, by the way, is played by Chain Tatum. And before 21 Jump Street came around, because of course this film got released like a year, about a year before 21 Jump Street hit theaters, this is the film that made me become a fan of Shane Tatum's comic work. You know? I mean, I've seen Shane Tatum try his hand at acting a couple of times. I was never a fan of his acting. Like, before, you know, stuff like Foxcatcher came around, or before, like, you know, 21 Jump Street came around. I've only seen him in stuff like the Step Up films. I've only seen him pretty much as the, uh, you know, pretty much as the good-looking guy, you know, that lots of females want to be with and whatnot. He, he's pretty much the uh, handsome fella. But, I mean, I had no, no idea that he could do comedy until I saw The Dilemma. He was so darn good in this film. I mean, his scenes with uh, Kevin James was pretty cool. His scenes with uh, Why Not Rye was decent. Uh, you also had... So anyway, uh, so of course Vince Vaughn's character is having a dilemma. Like, should, should he tell his best friend about the um, affair and stuff like that? Uh, the film also features Jennifer Connelly, who of course worked with Ron Howard on uh, Be Off of Mind. She was pretty good in this. Uh, you got Queen Latifah, who portrays their uh, boss. Queen Latifah was pretty good in this film. Uh, you even had, uh, yeah, why not Rar, she was really saw on this. I mean, yeah, this movie is, it's hilarious. It's really funny. It's very, uh, charming. Uh, the chemistry between Kevin James and uh, Vince Vaughn worked out perfectly. Uh, the film is scripted by Alan Lowe, who did a pretty good job with the, uh, screenwriter. And, yeah, I mean, this is, this is a really funny film. I mean, it, like I said, it doesn't really, it didn't really get much love when it got released. Uh, but it's much better, better than Chris Mayage beat. Sally only has a 24% of Rotten Tomatoes. Did not do so well when it got released. It only made about 69.7 million. Didn't do so well, but the dilemma is, is awesome. Uh... Yeah, crazily that come January, the dilemma is going to be 10 years old. Just wrap your heads around that right there. But anyway, yeah, definitely go check out the dilemma if you guys never seen it. Anyway, let me leave you guys. Have you ever seen uh, Ron Harris' The Dilemma? If so, what you doing? Did you like it? Did you not like it? Drop comments below. Don't forget to like, subscribe, hit that bell for more notifications. This is Simu, sign off.